We know from the information you recovered from the Vahar system that the Tal Shiar are planning to attack a Riemann settlement in the Dara system. We have an opportunity to reach the settlement first. This may be a completely internal matter, and if so, the Prime Directive will come into play. We will not be able to interfere. But if there is an outside influence directing these matters, we must know what it is. Our encounters with the Undine and the Changelings have proven that there are entities attempting to move the powers of the Quadrant like pieces in a cow toe game. It is essential to protecting the Federation to see these attempts for what they are and counter them. I want you to go to the Dara system and learn more about the Riemann uprising. The Riemanns will have hidden their base, so you may have to use subterfuge to find it. One more thing. I realize this is a dangerous situation and that you may be drawn into conflict, but do not antagonize the Remans or the Romulans if you can avoid doing so. We are already at war with the Klingon Empire. I would prefer to avoid another extended conflict. Since the destruction of Romulus, the Federation has done all it can for the survivors and the Romulan colony worlds. Many of our aid shipments were stolen or diverted for use by the Romulan military. Others were rejected out of pride or suspicion. Nonetheless, we will not stop. It is my belief that a lasting peace with the Romulans is possible, but it will not be attained through treaties. Only by reaching out to individuals, as you did in the Vahar system, can we sweep away decades of mistrust and hostility?
about vengeance.
This place won't be safe forever. We have to be ready to leave at a moment's notice. Prepare the... Ah, it's you. Welcome to the heart of the Resistance, little spy. There is so much for us to discuss, and so little time. The Tal Shiar have discovered this, our last refuge. They will be here soon, and my people and I will have to fight for our lives. Yet one question remains. Will you be our friend, or our enemy? My hope is that you are here to talk, but I am prepared for the alternative. The Tal Shiar could arrive at any time. Speak quickly. Why? You ask why? This place is one of the last sanctuaries left to my people, and even it is lost to us now. The Romulans have driven us from our homes, destroyed our ships, and captured or killed our loved ones. They seek to exterminate us, and we will not go quietly. Understand, I do not want this war. I want freedom for my people. It is the Romulans and the Dark Masters they serve who have caused this. Now they must suffer the consequences. Is there anything else you wish to- Hakiv and the Tal Shiar no longer serve the Empire. The demons of air and darkness are their masters now. They whisper in the night for chaos and despair. And Hakiv gives them blood as tribute. Our blood. Is there anything else you wish to ask? I have never seen one of these demons, and I will not speak their name, but I know they exist. Eons ago, they ruled this part of the galaxy. After thousands of years of tyranny and death, the races they ruled rose up against them, driving them from their home world into unexplored space. We thought they had been destroyed. We were wrong. The demons of air and darkness survive, and they hunger for revenge. Is there anything else you wish to ask? A small supply. They are terrible things. Weapons of war so horrible, they should have never been invented at all. But they were. And my enemies are great. If I must resort to barbarism to free my people, that is not too high of a price to pay. Is there anything else you wish to ask? There will be no peace. Not while Hakiv lives. This is not a problem that can be solved by diplomacy. Hakiv kills my people, I kill his. That is how it will be, until one of us is dead. Is there anything else you wish to ask? We need your help. Talk to Starfleet Command. Tell them what you have seen. Tell them if my people are to survive, we need assistance. Starships, soldiers, medicine, protection for the refugees. I'm asking for the Federation's aid. You claim to be an organization dedicated to freedom for all peoples. Tell me, will you help my people now? Is there anything else you wish to ask? I am glad you see things my way. Get instructions from your commanders if you must, but the battle rages and we must join it. With your help, my people will be free. I'm pleased you see that my cause is just. We can do great- Sir, Romulan transporter signals detected. I will return to my ship and attempt to hold off their forces. Help my soldiers defend this base. Start the evacuation. We must get the civilians out. The Tal Shiar have entered the base. Commander Roshna, transport the reinforcements here. Tell them to assist our new ally. Security forces transporting. Fight well, my friend. My people are counting on you.
I sympathize with Obasek's plight, but I do not know if we will be able to assist him. He has no proof of these demons that he claims are directing Hakiv's actions. Without that, becoming directly involved in this conflict would be a violation of the Prime Directive. We will protect the Federation, offer aid to the refugees, and keep this conflict from spilling over into our territory. But if Obasek and his followers are going to continue this fight, they will do so without Starfleet support. Congratulations, Admiral. I agree with you. There is more to this story, and we must continue to follow the trail until all is revealed. As I have said, directly assisting the Remans against the Tal Shar would be interfering with an internal affair, and that is prohibited by Starfleet regulation. However, I will authorize you to continue investigating this matter. If you can find evidence that supports Obasek's claims, then more options will be open to us. My contacts tell me that Star...